The conference brought together physical education teachers and other educational and sporting professionals across the island to share best practices, identify issues affecting the teaching and learning of physical education and sports, to discuss strategies to address these issues and to establish professional connections. The conference fostered collective commitment towards leveraging physical education and sports as a powerful instrument for sustainable development. Cyrus Sipal, Deputy Chief Education Officer, spoke on behalf of Education Minister Honorable Sean Edward, who was unable to attend the event. But let me tell you that the Ministry of Education and by extension this administration understand the benefits of physical education and sports to the development of this country and we have made significant investment in this area. We have dedicated physical education teachers at every primary and secondary school. A huge statement for a country of our size, of, of our size and limited resources. We have programs at our schools that allow our teachers to identify and develop talent. This year's conference featured several presentations from local and regional presenters on varying subjects, sharing their expertise and insights into effectively integrating physical education and sports into the broader agenda of sustainable development. Education Officer for Camdu, Gianetti George, called on conference participants to seize the opportunity to exchange ideas and to collaborate on the innovative solutions to inspire each other and to take concrete actions towards a more sustainable future. From promoting health and well-being to fostering social inclusion, enhancing educational outcomes, and preserving our environment, physical education and sports have the potential to address multiple dimensions of the Sustainable Development Goals, or the SDGs. The activities featured speaker Chanel Falmi is the lead officer of the Sustainable Development Goals within the Department of Sustainable Development. She centered her message on the people theme of the 2030 Global Agenda for Sustainable Development, which she says relates more closely to the subject of physical education. In this case, so we're trying to ensure that our people, our economy, our social life, we are trying to ensure that our future generation is able to use our environment, able to have a better life than us. So even though you may not automatically think sports, it is important towards sustainable development. The UN themselves have said that um, sports and physical education is critical to us achieving sustainable development. Injury prevention, the key to good governance and administrative reform, creating and maintaining healthy athletes by integrating reflexive performance reset and physical education focus on special needs, were some of the main subjects dealt with at the 6th Annual Physical Education and Sports Conference. The activity culminated with the election of the St. Lucia Physical Education Teachers Association to elect a new executive for the organization. From the Communications Unit of the Department of Education, Innovation and Vocational Training, I am Chris Satney, reporting.